What's good people? Guna Matli here. So in today's video, I will be doing a preview of the Arsenal Nottingham Forest game, which will be kicking off later on today at 2 p.m. I'll also be doing my starting 11 and my match predictions. So I've been having a look back at the, the last six Arsenal games and uh, the drop in form that we've had. And what I've seen is in the last six games, we've had four, four away games. And in them games, we've had to travel to Norway, Leeds, Southampton, then Holland. We've had two home games in at the start. One of them was against Liverpool. And then in between all of them games, we've had PSV at home, which are not two easy teams to play against. So it got me thinking. It's a lot of travelling to be doing for such a young squad. And this squad's not used to be playing like Thursday, Sunday. So that's every three days. And um, yeah, so no wonder why we're having a little bit of drop in form. But I wouldn't be too worried yet. You know what I mean? And our home form at the moment, to be honest, is, is fantastic. But, and um, I was looking at our fixtures that are going ahead, our next few fixtures. And out of the last four fixtures that we've got, we three them right at home. So that's that's not too bad. So yeah, I, I, I really do think we should be winning Nottingham Forest, therefore at home. No disrespect to them. But um, yeah, on Forest, on the other hand, I've only managed one win in their last six, drawing two and then losing three. Their win did come against Liverpool, which was was less less than get no joke. There it was like like a really good game. Um, yeah, so they'll be up for that. That that was their last game as well, literally being Liverpool. So yeah, they're gonna be up for it. But um, yeah, us us at home. Given our home form, given the crowd, I really do see us winning this game. You know what I mean? I don't. No disrespect to Forest, we should be winning. It's quite comfortable too. Like I um, I was lucky enough to go to the Spurs game a few weeks back, and the atmosphere was fantastic. So I know I know firsthand our crowd is going to do some good stuff for the team. And. Nottingham Forest away form is quite poor, really. I don't really see them doing anything to us. I really don't see anything other than an Arsenal win, to be honest. And like I said, no, that's no no disrespect to Nottingham Forest, but we should be trying to get our form back now. We've got a home game against Forest, a home game against Zurich. Both games, let's just say we are a better team. No disrespect to either team. We should be winning quite comfortably in my eyes. Um, my prediction for the game, I'd say a 3-4-0 win. Really, really don't see anything else other than that. Um, and we really need a win now. You know what I mean? We need a com comprehensive win as well. You know what I mean? We need to bounce back and really show that we mean something now. Like I said, then, then we've got Zurich at home. So we can get two wins on a bounce there before playing Chelsea. You never know. Our, our last few times we played Chelsea at Chelsea, we, we've looked quite well, you know what I mean? We beat them quite a lot of the time. So the, they just lost as well today. So that don't look too good for them either, you know what I mean? So bring on the next few games, I say. I really do. Um, so my starting 11 would be Ramsdale in goal, Ben White at right back, Saliba and Gabriel, both centre-backs, Kieran Tini starting at left back. My centre midfielders would be Partey, Xhaka, Odegaard, left wings Martinelli, Saka right wing, Jesus up front. Um, yeah, so like, like I said, no disrespect to Nottingham Forest or Zurich, but we should be smashing both teams at home. And if we can't do that, then we, we are really in trouble. <laughs> um, yeah, this is a bit of a quick one. It's not going to be too long. Like I said, it's just a quick preview of the game. And I hope we Arsenal can bounce back good now. You know what I mean? Um, so I'll be back again with a post-match review at some point after the game. But until then, I hope you I hope you really enjoyed the video. Could everyone please like, subscribe, and tell everybody about me, please? Like I said, I'm I'm new to YouTube. Only two weeks ago I started my channel. Really trying to get it going off. Bear in mind I'm just doing it off my phone yet, so I 
I'll start being a bit more professional in the next few weeks. I'm going to get a laptop sorted out, get a banner sorted out, an introduction, to get the channel going properly. But for now, it's just off my phone. And yeah, just a big love to everybody and thanks for watching. Thanks for, for, for liking and subscribing. Um, yeah, and until my next video, it's Gruner Muttley, the Arsenal YouTube correspondent, signing off. Thanks again, guys. Take care. Come on, you gunners.